Hey guys, so I'm heading to the beach and I'm sorry he is crying like crazy because it's what he does best is whine. Anyways, yeah, we're going to the beach. I'm taking just him today because it is hard to control both of them. And then on my next beach visit, I will take the other one. So, yeah. Hopefully he goes smoothly. Hopefully he doesn't go crazy. I hope he walks better than he does in the neighborhood, but we'll see. Anyways, I'll see you guys when we get to the beach. So here we are, guys. I pray my dog doesn't annoy the shizzle out of me. I already turned another one. This one lady was walking by with her smaller dog, and I am not prepared to be embarrassed by that. Junior, stop. So here's the beach, Long Beach. So overall nice looking beach. When your dog isn't going half as crazy as if he's never been outside. Easy boy. Yeah, what's there? Good boy. Okay, easy. So we're gonna walk up there. Let me pause this. And so now we are in the dunes. He's starting to get on my last nerve. I don't know why he always acts like he's never been outside. has grown a lot. Last time I was here it was for New Year's and we were sitting here on the grass somewhere. Oh, was there like a fire? There's some missing patches of the grass but it looks like some type of cars have been in here. It's beautiful though guys. Sorry if the camera's shaky. I do not have my selfie stick. I figured I would not take that with me. Junior, do you like it? Yeah? It's nice. Just hate how people have this dog sometimes because you never know how your dog and another dog would be if they were to approach each other. So this is more of the grassy area. I'm sorry for my dog, guys. He's a big crybaby. Believe it or not, pit bulls are ginormous crybabies big time cry babies cry baby lovers everything come on let's go i should just call him cry baby from now on i hope he doesn't go down there thinking oh yes okay good he knows where i want to go up here up here nice try so where i want to go down is i want to walk up this dune because it doesn't seems like there's no dogs here. so i'd rather be on the safe side than anything and it's like Hardly any grass. I don't know what what has happened. Usually it's filled with like the dunes, which is this stuff. Hey, settle down, Junior, please. But yeah, Junior, do you like it? It's a really nice area. Again, I apologize if my hand is shaky. It's a little bit windy here. And it's almost about the sunset's about to go down any minute pretty much so yeah. let's pray he doesn't poop here all right so i was thinking maybe we could go down to the beach is that guy walking on that edge of the boardwalk over there weirdly weird maybe it's not even a guy but let's pray they don't fall or break their neck or something there's a couple people down there with their cars I've been to a bon bonfire once. It was interesting. I don't really go to them, but maybe it's because I don't know of any. I'm just not an outgoing person anymore. Like I used to be. Junior, you like it? Look at him, he's overwhelmed with joy. He's like, oh yeah. Uh, I should have bought my other dog, but it's hard to control both, but I'll bring him next time. Next time I get a free chance, maybe this weekend, hopefully if the weather's nice, I'll take him out. Oh, buddy! Where's Zeus? Anyways, yeah. People are flying kites over there. to stop for a show you guys how it looks and of course the second I stop is the second 
this guy decides to be a crybaby. Right, Junior? You gonna tell him you're a crybaby? It is beautiful though, oh my god. You guys, I don't know if my phone does it justice, but it's nice. I'm glad I finally managed to get out for a bit. I need to do this more often. It's nice out here on the beach. It's nice to take your dogs out. And up here, all the dunes seems to be have disappeared. Well, to have, I don't know what the hell. Maybe they got burned down because of a fire or just not growing right here. I don't know. But usually, the 4th of July, guys, they have the fireworks lit over here. And you can literally see them right in front of you, which is nice. I think, like, last no probably not last year but last year somebody did die i think i believe for fourth of july but um even the year before it's sad a lot of tourists around here just come here and they don't realize how dangerous our beaches is because the waves here the waves here are really really strong i don't know if the camera does it justice but yeah, it's the strong winds Alright guys, so I was just about to have a panic attack. My dog decided he wanted to chew on the leash and he did so. So me and him had a like two minute tug of war session for me trying to get him to get let loose of this damn leash. And then he finally did and then I noticed my phone was out of my pocket. So I'm freaking out looking for it all over the place. And then I finally found it. Sorry, I hate when he does this because he acts like, he behaves like a wild pit bull that he knows he isn't. Like, just so embarrassing. Look, like I couldn't control my dog. Every single time I take him out, he does something to fucking make me mad. Pardon my French, guys, but I honestly panicked because I thought my phone was gone. And I have this, like, gray, like, case on it, which was even harder to find in this gray sand. So I was like, fuck. Like, I was about to call my mom. Thank God she gave me her phone. Because I need to pay my phone bill, but thank God. Because I was about to have our dog. See what he does? This shit that I'm tired of. Come on, boy. He better not do that. Because that shit's annoying as fuck. Look, what does he think he's going to chew his way out off the leash? <sighs> I thought I lost my phone. I honestly thought. But look at this beautiful hotel. Or whatever that is. I always wonder how you get to those hotels. Because I know there's those world mark ones or whatever that you can go to over there but yeah I don't know come on boy let's go I swear if you even try to bite the leash again you're gonna be dead not literally dead but you're gonna be in trouble and you won't come to the beach anymore so yeah but we're still walking around luckily no dogs up here and yeah it's a nice day sorry my eyes are watery because I just got sat in my eyes not fun but it's nice out here. I picked up my hair because if I didn't, then it would be all over the place. And it's hard walking on the beach with blowing hair and a dog. So yeah, anyways, it's gorgeous out here. If you guys can see, very beautiful. Junior! There's my brat baby. Next time I'm gonna bring my smaller dog here, Seuss. So it'll be fun. Oh boy, look at him, you guys. Wow, nice little mess you made. Good boy. Normally you don't encourage this kind of behavior, but we're on the beach, so it's okay. Here, boy, come. Come, come. Get him. Get him. Now he's trying to bite the leash, which is even more embarrassing. So I'm not going to encourage him any more digging right now. But anyways, yeah. It is beautiful out here. Oh, there's a person with their dog. Hmm. Let's keep out of sight. Right, Junior? Yeah. It is beautiful. The sky is pretty. Everything is just spectacular. That is a weird word, but I had to use it. How embarrassing is it when your dog doesn't listen to you? Very embarrassing. Junior? Oh, is he gonna dig his own hole over there or what? What's there? Please don't tell me you're gonna poop right now. Which will be fine because there's not really anybody besides those people on the boardwalk over there. That's it. Out here. 
It's beautiful. It's breathtaking. That weird green thing that keeps appearing on my camera. This guy who's like digging for clouds or something. Good boy, let's go. He's, he's acting possessed, so maybe it'll be time for me to take him back. I don't know. Eh, with my other dog, it's much easier. You guys see that light all the way in the ocean over there? That orange light all the way in the back. That's crazy. I went once on a boat though, like, I mean, I've been on boats before, but I mean, like, small boats, like, we went on a boat where we would go tubing all the time when I was younger, like, during my childhood and, and all, but when I moved here, I got a chance to go on a crabbing boat or whatever, people just going out for crabs, I guess, and it was pretty cool, I felt bad, because the poor crabs, you know, weren't gonna make it, but, uh, you know, there's not much you can do. We got some, we were able to take some, the guys let us, me and my uncle. And I think my brother was with us too. Yeah, he probably was. But they let us take some crabs back. And I was gonna keep one, and I was really young. I was like, oh, I wanna keep one for my fish tank. But I didn't, obviously, because a crab won't fit in a fish, a fish tank. But it was like those really humongous red crabs. This guy's finding stuff, I don't know what. What is it, boy? Hmm? Anyways, like I was telling that story earlier that People here think the beach is safe to swim, like every time tourists come, especially for during 4th of July weekend or whatever, they just come here and they don't realize that how dangerous our, our um, waves are. We have signs out here that say like, you know, don't swim or whatever the things are, but it's the kids usually that the parents leave unattended and then they get swept to the ocean. Like last time, I think it was two years ago or something, a girl and a boy were in the ocean. The boy made it, but his sister, I think it was, did not make it. It was sad we were a little sad and I think she was like 12 and she drowned and they found her later I think hours later or maybe a day later in the in, somewhere out here I don't know where exactly it was but it's crazy like that's that's not a death I wish upon anybody not even my worst enemy he's literally found something guys what is it did he find something is that dog poop or what the fuck is that are you finding dog pooping nasty but yeah I don't know this guy looks nice so yeah and then all this rain it rains huge puddles of grass, I mean huge puddles of obviously water in the grass, the grass, the grass, the dune grass. I cannot speak anymore, guys. I am sorry. I need to retire from speaking if that's possible. And I think I just fucked up my makeup, my eyeliner. That is at least. We better hurry up, Junior, before a car comes here. Or I mean, see, guys, I don't know what I'm saying. Before dog comes here oh, yeah i did mess up my eyeliner a little bit but i fixed it anyways um yeah we are headed back sort of by the time this guy decides to stop sniffing every piece of grass we can get back to the car Whew. anyways i hope you guys enjoy this video i wasn't out for much which i'm not going to be out for much anyways because it's about to be sunset the beach looks nice during sunset maybe i can like film a video or something show you guys better but this guy who has to sniff every inch of grass <sighs> too much anyways yeah i'll see you guys, okay, guys so we are in the car now and of course he interrupts me just because he sees little hot dog dogs outside yeah this is why i don't like to have dogs around in person it's always crazy 